Hey everybody, happy Friday! We are finally to uh, the weekend, so I'm super excited. Uh, and today is actually one of my favorite days of the week is because I get to interview I get to interview somebody, some, you know, and other streamers. Sorry if I seem so off. <laughs> I feel so rushed today. Um, no, but I am very excited. We are going to have a very special guest today. And um, if, and you guys are able or, or you guys can ask questions as well. Um, sometimes if I do miss them or uh, let's say I don't ask them right away, it might just be because... Take a sip, bitch. <laughs> this is a fucking captain of wine mixer. Thanks, Rain. Thank you for the sip. I appreciate it. How are you? Happy Friday. Mm. Thank you. <laughs> um, no, but if anybody has any questions for our guest, um, I might just miss it just because got to start the stream. Right. Trolla, how you doing, Trolla? How are you? How's the fam? <laughs> how's Rolla? hey um we need to play together again because i've been getting <laughs> well i don't know if i should say this but i've been getting a little bit better i've been getting a little bit better better especially i've been playing a little bit more warzone lately so um definitely we should try it again i'm down um no but I, as i was saying for our special guests if anybody has any questions please don't be afraid to ask them um also if Anytime. Yeah, I'll let you know. I'll let you know, Trolla. I've been trying to get to play with Rolla, too, and Mushu. I think we should all four get on there, and I think that'd be interesting. You have gone a bit better. <laughs> Thank you, Rolla. Thank you. See, I have a... um. What's the word when you say that you have somebody to back you? See, I have somebody to back me up. There. That That's what I was trying to say. Anyways, <laughs> but I think, I think it'd be cool if it was Trolla, Rolla, Mushu, and I... That would be really cool, but I know with four people on Warzone, the maps are smaller, so it gets a little bit more crazier. It reminds me of Shipment, almost, when you go and play Shipment, um, except there's like four, like 40 other people there. Uh, that Yeah, that would be epic. I think that'd be super cool, especially because I keep hearing Mushu's a beast and watching her. She's actually really, really good. So I love, and you are too, Trolla. Rolla, I don't know. I've never seen Rolla play COD, but we have played zombies together and he's actually very good. Big map quad is still big. Oh, okay, okay. Quads is still big. All right, all right. Yeah, that'd definitely be epic. I'll probably, <laughs> probably die a lot. I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna die a lot. Um... So, but, um, uh, anyways, guys, uh, what time is it? Oh, okay. So, yeah, any questions today for the guests? If I miss them, don't be afraid to ask your question again or highlight it. Um, and I'll try to get to it as soon as I can. I'm very, I'm not very good. Really? I don't believe you because you're very, you're good in zombies when we play zo zombies. Uh, Elvis dad. Hi, Elvis dad. How are you? How have you been? I haven't seen you in a while. How are things going? Who's the guest? Uh, the special guest is going to be SBK Blur. I don't know if you have met S um, SB, um, Elvis dad, or, or I know Rolla has, I know Rain has, um, zombies don't shoot back. <laughs> Don't stop. I'm just trying to help the situation. That's all that I'm trying to do. Um, but yeah, SB, so... Um, before we get SB on here in a few minutes, there's um, there are a couple. Let me talk about him a little bit. Um, I just met SB a, a, not that long ago. I think we've known each other for maybe a little bit over a week now. I think it's been two weeks now, and he just joined the community. And already, he's just been super. He's been super amazing. He's been very supportive. Um, and just so you guys know, he's non affiliate. Oh, by the way, hold on. Let me give you a shout out, Trolla. My bad. Sorry. My bad. Speaking, yeah, because speaking of um, of streamers, Trolla is actually a streamer who plays COD. And um, his link is right there. So don't be afraid to give him a follow. Don't be afraid to go over there and show support as well. Uh, very, he's very funny. I'll, I'll get, he is very funny in the games, but he, and he takes them serious. And he's actually, he's very good. He played with me once and, I'm, and he had a, actually had a lot of patience with me, which I appreciate so much. Yeah, yeah, he rages. So Trolla rages. So if you like rage, if you like seeing that type of stuff, don't be afraid to check him out. Um, but speaking of S of Blur, I, I call I'm, I'm calling him SB, but usually I call him Blur. So speaking of Blur, yeah, like so we just met. He just joined the community. He's been super awesome, super supportive. Um, he's still a non-affiliate, but um, he's getting very close. Um, so please don't be afraid. I'm actually gonna put it out here right now. 
shout out S B. Let me see. Oh, S B K. There, that should. Why isn't it going? There we go. Um, so yeah, don't be afraid to give him a follow. Um, actually, Chola, he he plays COD as well, and he's actually he's very good. He's actually very good as well. Um, I think he does a lot more Warzone than multi. I know he does rank. He likes playing ranked a lot. So definitely check him out. Super cool. Um, but oh, it's already eight oh five. All right, so let's get this ready. Hold on, let me get this ready. So I'm gonna call him. Real quick. I'm so excited. I'm like turning it up because I don't know if it's like super low, but I'm big wars. Yeah, he does that. He does wars on ranked. So um, you should check him out sometime or I'll introduce you guys because he's, he's actually really good. He is very good. And you just can't hide. You just can't. Um, also, uh, persistent. I don't know if you ever met persistent Baylor. Yeah. He he's very good as well. I'm here. Hello. How are you? Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Okay. All right. One second. All right, here, no problem. You're good, bro. You're good. Okay. Good. Yeah. Let's go. Yeah. Okay. Um, you probably you might not be able to see like me. That? Like my camera? Say my camera. Huh? You, I don't say my camera, you might not be able to see me. No, that's okay. I'm gonna open up the stream. I was late. You're okay. Why is it doing that? All right, whatever. As long as we can see you, that's all I care about. Um, but yeah, let me know when you're got... ready. One second. Okay. Hey, Ice, how are you? Oh. Ooh, ooh, now I gotta fix the background on my camera. I was fucking around with it a little bit. Oh, gotta okay. Back to normal. Uh, I'm not sure. I'm not sure, Elvis Dad. All right, Tony. Hello, hello from the other side. Hello from the faraway <laughs> land. Oh, oh no. <laughs> persistent. No. How are you doing, Persistent? How is it going? Yadi, okay. Daddy, hello. I'm here. <laughs> Yadi, did, are you not streaming today? Because I was like waiting. I was like waiting for it to pop up. Thank you for being here, Yadi. I appreciate it. Okay. All right, Salty, welcome in, Salty. All right, you ready? You ready, fixed. Blur? Yes. All right, perfect. Um, all right, you guys, please give a round of applause to Blur. <laughs> um, yeah, so I've known Blur from, I think, two weeks now. It's been a couple weeks now. He just came into the community. He's new, but he's been so great, like I was saying earlier. He's been such a supporter. He's he's a very cool guy, um, and I'm so thankful that he's letting me um, interview him today, especially on a Friday night. Um, but please give a round of applause to Blur, and if you like to um check out his twitch i have his link up top pinned don't be afraid to give him a follow but like i always say please follow through and show that love and support but blur before we start please tell everybody who you are and a little bit about yourself oh shoot uh i'm blur also known as hunter uh yeah i'm just uh i'm just a casual dude i just i just like showing people love that's who i am that's what i'm about that's what I do daily. Um, I have a fiance. She's like the most beautiful thing ever. 
I love her in my life, you know. She's changed a lot about me, and uh, yeah. I'm also like a really hardcore gamer. Oh and yeah. That's me. I was actually telling, I was, I was, so I don't know if you can see chat, but Trolla underscore 81, he's, he plays uh, Warzone ranked. And I was actually telling him about you and that you're very good. I'm not the greatest, but I am, I am pretty good. <laughs> I wish I was the greatest. But, yeah, but still, I think still being pretty good is a thing. Um, but, but as we get started, just let you know, Jenna. Huh. Your mic, you sound like a robot on my end. That's just... I sound like a robot? I don't know. Hold on. Yep. Why didn't you say anything? Hold on. I sound like a robot. I wonder if... Hold on. Let me... Am I echoing? No, you're not echoing. It just sounds like a... Sounds like you're sputtering out, you know? Oh, okay. Hold on. BRB, guys. Yeah, it sounds great on stream. But on my end, it's, uh, it's a little roughy. Um... I don't know how I'm going to fix it. Well, maybe maybe I'm just too close to the mic, I'm wondering. Uh, does that sound better? A light, a light echo. It'll be all right. Are you sure? Yeah. I got it. Okay. I was going to say I could try to figure it out. Um, let me go back. It does sound like a clear problem, don't it? No. All right, then let's get started. Um, so first question, Blair. What did you uh, do before streaming? Well, I was a welder at Tenneco. Oh, wow. And uh, yeah, so it was like really, it was a really tough job. It was really hot. I didn't really enjoy it. But then I joined my dad's business, which has been going pretty well. And, uh, yeah, I, I was, I was like a full time, almost 80 hours a week person in, in a factory. It was bad. Oh, damn. Yeah, that, that's a lot. So, so then what got you into streaming? Um, well, my buddy dark, uh, he, uh, he, uh, I've known him for six years. Um, He's all the way out in the NC, and uh, he just was like, "Hey, dude, we game a lot. We game all the time. I think you should need. I think you need to record or stream what we're doing." And it just kind of, I just started doing it. Now I'm here. <laughs> so I remember yep. you. I remember you saying that you had started, it. and then you took, you had taken a break. Um, how long did you take a break from streaming? I was, I stopped streaming for like six months because my aunt ended up passing away. Um, Sorry for your loss again. Yeah, it was, it was very bad. But all in all, I came back and I was like super hype. So I was, um, before I met you guys, I was really trying to find some people like you. So I'm like, it's kind of like a smash in the face. Like, hey, I found I found some good people to like <laughs> hang out with. Finally, let's go. You know. <laughs> oh yeah, there's a lot of. I think there's a well, not I think, but I know there's a lot of cool people in the Discord server, and not even just in the I server, love... but in chat too. I yeah, there there's uh -huh. some there's some goofballs. I think I must say. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I like that. Um, we all have like the similar like humor. And we all know that uh, we're like joking. <laughs> um, so despite the six months from you not streaming, how long have you been streaming for? I'm coming. How, how long would that be, babe? How long do you think I've been streaming? Like a year now? In total, like a year. Oh, OK, that's pretty. Yeah. That's not bad. That's a, that's actually pretty cool. Are you going to did you yeah. do anything? Are you going to celebrate your one year anniversary? When is my one-year anniversary for, for streaming, do you know? My fiancé is going to look that up. <laughs> I'm going to get back to you on that one. Okay. That was cool. Um, welcome in, Brad. Welcome in, Turner. Clam Slam up, Persistent. Yeah. Thank you guys for being here. Yeah. I probably got drunk, maybe. I probably got drunk. I started in September. 
Oh, so it of just Blackbeard. happened. So it just happened. Yeah. You need a you need to do like a celebratory stream and just celebrate. <laughs> Get yeah. everyone fucked up. I might. I don't know. Um so so your username is SBK Blur. Um can you tell me the story behind it? Well, <laughs> that's uh so I was in a clan for a while. Um I played like way back in the day in BO2, I ran a clan that is named Obey. But we ended up switching it to SBK because uh, it was kind of like a I was like, I was, I was like 16 and I was just like, Hey, this is going to be a cool name. So like, fuck it. You know, like it wasn't like anything spectacular. I just thought like SBK sounded cool behind blur. So I was like, you know, let's just all switch SBK. So like, there's just like 15 random people that have SBK behind their name now <laughs> from BO2 okay. just roaming out there somewhere. <laughs> so that's how that happened. So where do you get blur from? Um, that part was just kind of like always there. Um, so there was like a pixel peak back in the day in BO2 and raid, and you could only see a blur of it. And I would always sit there. So my cousin Davion, uh, was like, why are you always blurring out? You fucking blur fuck or just something with blur in it. Just uh -huh. making fun of me because I'm always sit. I was always sitting in that, that spot, you know? So uh, I was like, I'm just going to put that in my name just because, you know, that was kind of like my spot, you know? Yeah. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Um, so how would you say, would you say that your content has maybe changed since you've started? 100%. I think. Okay. How so? And a lot, a lot, a lot of that has to do with with you guys and everyone around, oh, wow. I think. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, how so though? Like, um, can you give me an example? I just feel like I'm more energetic. Like before I was just like, I didn't, well, for one, I didn't have a face cam for two. I would just, I would straight up game instead of, uh, talk to people. I, I wouldn't, I wouldn't try as hard. You know, I would just kind of lay back, vape a little, get off for I would, I, and i would actually play like super long hours like i wouldn't have a sleep schedule it was super unhealthy but now it's just like hey i have a i have like a i have a schedule now i have a i have like a basis of what i want to do and my gaming has gotten a whole lot better wow okay that's pretty cool i was gonna and, say and, and, <laughs> no, you're and, good. and yes i like to show my dick on discord oh you saw <laughs> oh no you don't, don't even start don't even start Professor, do not even start with that do not start that with him please <laughs> then we're gonna <laughs> uh -huh. I, I got you persistent um, oh shit. <laughs> oh i'm sorry oh okay so so i know you kind of just talked about this a little bit about feeling like that you've been changing as a streamer take a like sip, you said oh fucking hold on i gotta mixer. i gotta take a sip if, are you drinking with me i got my vape <laughs> okay okay I that's well, fine I can... no that's okay no it's okay i got one don't worry all right cheers cheers where's my can where's my opener you know Upstairs. Oh, I drink. Yeah. I might have to run upstairs to grab my fucking bottle just, opener. Just break the bottle and drink it yeah. from there. Fuck it. <laughs> I just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> you missed what he showed us. Wait, what? What did you show them last night? While we wait. Hey, don't go there. What? I want to know. I want to know what was no, shown. What did I miss after no, you I went don't. to bed? Nah. What did I miss? I want to know. I want to know. 
All right, buddy. Good night, Salty. Thank you for being Sorry, here. Sorry, I was late to the phone you. call, by the way. You made a phone call? Yeah, thank you. Well, the Discord call. My bad. Oh, okay. <laughs> phone call. Sorry. I'm old school, I guess. So what was it? So Nothing. It was nothing. <laughs> Chad was wants nothing. to know. Nothing at all. Wait, don't tell her. Don't There's show nothing. her. What? Don't show. Why? How are you going to bring it up and then not, not talk about it? Salty, I appreciate it. I didn't bring it up. Persistent brought it up. That's why I'm saying I'm talking to Persistent. All right. Um. So I know you were just talking about um, how you've changed a little bit with your stream. Um, you as a person, you said that you've been feeling more energetic. You kind of have a yeah. schedule now. You become, you're becoming a better gamer. Um, is there anything else that you feel like that's, that's kind of changed, I guess? Like, I don't know how to explain. Um, do you feel like you're cha like, I guess, changing as a streamer? Cause I know you said that you've been learning like a lot more stuff, especially in the, sh like with the streaming industry. Yeah. Um, I just, uh, it's kind of come down to like before I didn't really have a, what would you say? Like, a, I didn't, I didn't really too much care for, what's the word I'm looking for? I didn't too much care for it. It was just kind of something that I did. You know what I mean? Yeah. And so like, now it's like, Hey, people are actually wanting to see me grow. I want to fucking do it. So I'm just kind of doing it. And that's kind of been the change. It's not like, not anything with me, like personally, cause like I've always loved people. I've always, you know, I've, I've always loved gaming. I've always yeah. loved like, just kind of like the aspect of streaming. I just didn't really too much care for it because like it wasn't anything before I met you guys. You know what I mean? So what would you say so, is your over goal now with streaming? Would you like it to be a career or do you just find it more kind of like a hobby? Right now, um, like like way in the future, I do want this to be a career. Like that's that's been my goal since I was like 16. Oh, wow. So okay. like I've always I've always wanted to stream. I've always wanted to like become bigger. But like there's always like that. There's always that aspect of like. Once you hit like a certain point, you're always going to see a downfall. Yeah. Right. Like there's always going to be like that, like, like that drop, you yeah. know? And so it's just kind of like mentally preparing for that, you know, cause not, not everyone is going to like your content or, and, and stuff like that. So. Yeah. Uh, so you said that you've been wanting to be a streamer since 16, who was the first streamer you ever watched? The very first streamer I ever watched was my boy, Nick Merckx. Nick Merckx. What is he? What does he stream? He, right now, he is actually streaming Apex, but before he would stream um, Halo. He streamed uh, Gears of War. He was like okay. super good. Uh, yeah, and he's which, he's really been my idol. Oh, yeah. I was about to ask you. I was going to say, like, is he the one that inspired you to start streaming? Yeah. Yep. Uh, just like his personality and his mm -hmm. love for people. You know, I was just like, that's who I want to be, you know, uh -huh. or the kind of person I want to be. I don't want to be him. I want to be Hunter. I don't want to be, you know. Yeah, no, I get, I definitely get what you mean. Um, for our next yeah. question, um, this is a this is a, a question from Red. It's um, it goes if Blur if Blur fingered his sister <laughs> pretending he has one if he doesn't and found his dad's wedding ring in her vagina. Would the would would you a confront your dad about it or b just put it put it back in there like nothing ever happened? Dude, I would just put it back in there and act like it never <laughs> happened, bro. <laughs> I okay. would I would just be like, go, dad. Yeah. No, no, okay, okay. W. All right, all right, all right. Back, okay. Go, dad. Um, he's like sixty. Oh, God. <laughs> uh, at least so, you're getting some. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> mm. 
Clam says, so you admit you would finger your sister? No. I'm just saying, like, if that ever were to occur, <laughs> like, I would just act. <laughs> That's okay. I'm not saying I would do it. But, like, if a situation occurred to where, like, maybe if I was, like, drunk or something, you know what I'm saying? I don't know. Oh, all right, guys. Back, no back, back to the streaming questions. Um, So, Blur, what is something that you would add or take off Twitch that could help streamers more? I would take off... Uh, Man, to be honest, I, no, I don't. I don't really know. To oh, be really? honest with you, I mean, it, it seems like it's pretty, pretty fair, and like you have to work for it. It's definitely like a, it's like a secondhand job, you know. It like it, you definitely have to, to get. You have to do like you have to grind it out to get it, you know. And and like if you just don't try, then you're not. You're not gonna. You're not gonna get to where you want to be. I don't think for no. me, I would just love, I was going to say for me, I would love if they took off um, like the strikes for music. I would. Yeah. Like I mean? the copyright. Yeah. Yeah. It's bullshit. <laughs> um, yeah, so, <fuckers. laughs> so what's something that you didn't know about streaming that, you know, now and wish you would have learned so sooner? Um, being able to network yourself and putting yourself out there. Cause like before I wouldn't do that. Nope. I, I would sit there and I would just hope for somebody to pop up in my stream. And then I would like, be like, Hey, what's up, dude? Welcome yeah. in, you know? <laughs> and then uh -huh. it, they, they would leave instead of actually growing and getting to know people and then them showing up, getting to know them. And then, and then, um, them just loving you back, you know? Like that's the that's the part where you have to kind of work for it, you know. Like you have to you have to show that you're that you're about it, and you have to show that you actually love the people that are coming and showing up. Oh yeah, isn't it? And I wasn't so, doing that. Before. I was gonna say, isn't it crazy how Discord has um, a really big effect on Twitch when like because like you said, growing and going out there and meeting people. Yeah, uh, it's it's definitely huge, and I would suggest to anybody to join up in any Discord. I mean, if like if the Discord was like toxic and dramatic, I would get the fuck out of there. But yeah. like, if you're gonna join a Discord, make sure it's a Discord with people that love to network with other people and 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 show show love to other people, especially if they're like non affiliate or even affiliate. You know, like mm -hmm. you just got to get the right people. You got to surround yourself with those people. Have you heard of cults in the streaming industry? Yes, yeah. yours. <laughs> you, what? No, your Discord. You're not supposed to say mine. <laughs> Your Discord. <laughs> My Discord is not a cult. Everyone, okay. First of all, everyone jokes that it's a cult. It's really not a cult. No. Uh, oh. I mean, pull up gang is kind of like a cult, you know? Like they all like the. <gasps> no, I'm just playing. No. <laughs> just. <laughs> I'm kidding. No, but I've heard of it. And yeah. like some people get like really weird about it. Yeah, did you know that in some servers, um, as at the as well, they also call them cults. But like the person that's running it will also like make you put their like clan tag, so everybody would have to have oh, their yeah. clan tag. Yeah. 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 <laughs> I've heard of that. I've actually been a part of. Well, it wasn't really Discord, but it was more like a. Uh... Have you ever heard of MySpace? Yeah, I've heard of MySpace. It was a MySpace. And it was for Halo. I actually was in a part of one. Oh, but it wasn't uh -huh. Discord. Uh-huh. How did that go? Not good. I left within a week. <laughs> oh wow. So already you're like these are these are intense vibes. Um, so 
Oh, oh, real quick, red and persistent. Those are would you rather questions and don't worry, I will get to those when we get to the would you rather section. So don't worry, I got you guys. I'll get back to your questions, promise. Wait, there's um, section, motherfucker? Yeah, I, I, <laughs> okay. so with my interviews, I do, I have like a whole, whole format and I'll have like different um, topics or I guess activities, maybe you would call them, that we do. So I hope you're ready. Oh god. Yeah, don't worry, Brad. I promise I will get to those would you rather questions. <laughs> Real quick. So Blur, um, what are some positive yes. and negative experiences you've had so far with streaming? Well, um I'm just gonna be straight up honest. Uh fuck. I'm going to go with negative first because there's been a lot. Um, oh, wow. Okay. There was a lot of people that kind of wanted me to stop streaming, and I kind of fell into temptation um, very early into my relationship, I would say. Right. With, with Autumn. And uh, I kind of fell, like, a lot. And uh, I, I went down a really dark road. And I dealt with a lot of like depression. I dealt with a lot of like, like a lot of overthinking things. It's just it, that, that brought up a lot of a, my, uh, of my past, I would say. And uh, the only positive side that f like to that negative would be um, the people that are the people that have been there since you know day one, like dark my cousin, you know, like all the OGs like of me that kind of helped me get out of the rut. And big shout out to my, my fiance. Cause she, she really, she stuck through like all the bull crap that I, that I put her through, you know, and she, oh, yeah. she knew that I could change and I ended up changing. So I just, I, I love her so much, you know, <laughs> for just kind of sticking there with me. Yeah. So yeah, there was some stuff where like, I got clipped, I got clipped. And, and it was shipped and they like some legal shit like almost went down but i ended up fixing all that shit up because i was getting blackmailed and shit like it was just it was a, there was a lot of bad situations that i'll never put myself in again that's crazy that is freaking crazy blackmail like who like yeah. why you know what i mean um so then what would you why? say is the well, well, yeah, like I would just like I understand why people blackmail, but to me, that's just really, that's just really crazy. I guess I would that the nicest way to put it. Yeah, uh, a lot of weird people out there, man. Oh yeah. <laughs> uh, so I was gonna say, uh, what would you say is the best part about streaming? Getting to know people, dude, and 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 showing up to other people's uh, streams. I would say that's the best yeah. part. Just yeah. showing, just showing. No, I'm not going to say showing. Just seeing <laughs> other people be a part. That's the greatest part. Having people and, 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 and knowing that, uh, knowing that they're there for you, you know, that's, oh. that's the biggest, my favorite part about streaming. Oh yeah, definitely. I, I definitely agree with you. Um, with that, because, um, I always tell people like the fact that like, like today right now, you know, like the people that show up and come and watch or just come here and support me and even when I'm doing terrible in the game and they're just like, no, Jenna, you're doing great. Just keep, just keep going. Good aim. Yeah. Yeah. Good aim. I was, good aim. <laughs> um, it's very good aim. <laughs> Uh, yeah i would say seriously um it really lines up my my heart because i'm just like wow like that's crazy but it's also like wow you know like, i don't even know what else to say it's just mm -hmm. wow <laughs> um i was gonna okay so what so what would you say is the most difficult about streaming because i know you mentioned earlier it's like a second like an, it's like another job The, the most difficult part would probably have to be, man, 
There's a couple. I would say setting setting yourself up for success. That's the hard part. Putting yourself in a good position. Mm-hmm. Um, if you don't, if you don't, people like to fuck with people's streams. Okay, and I've noticed this since you know I've watched streams. Like they just like to fuck with it. You know, like like they like to mess with you. They like to they like to have a good time. So setting those things up are like they're easy, but it takes a lot of time. So I think that's like the hardest part of just setting yourself up. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I, yeah, I could. Agree. Building your network is the hardest part. Mm, yeah, that that is, and and then like keeping those relationships after. Yeah. Yep. Especially when you just start to get to know so many people, and and it, it yeah. I'm not I'm not gonna lie, it, it it can be hard to kind of keep up with. Hmm. So what is something that you would do different if you could start completely over with streaming with the knowledge you have now? I wouldn't start streaming until I was in a discord with people that, that, that love, that love the, um, the atmosphere. I would also be doing a whole lot more social, um, social moving, if you know what I mean. Yes. I, I would put myself out there on my socials a lot more than what I have been. That's been a struggle. Oh, yeah. I struggle with that but, now. I won't even mention my other socials. I like completely forget about yeah. that. <laughs> um, no, I was just that you're a bitch. No, I'm, <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm kidding. No, I was, was going to say, so we had I had Boss Lady on here uh, maybe three or four weeks ago now. Yeah, about three weeks ago. Mm-hmm. And she actually explained that being a supporter first before a streamer um it makes like a whole huge difference because you're out yeah. there you're out there connecting with people you know and and right. those people and so when she had said that i was like wow that actually makes a lot of, that makes a lot of sense and she actually gave example of um this guy risky i don't know if you ever met risky ringo before he was a streamer mm-hmm. um he was just a major supporter and um and when he st- and she was like, you need a stream, you need a stream. And so when he finally got out there and started streaming, um, he he was just popping because all these people, you know, like they wanted to show him all this love. And so the fact that you said that is mm-hmm. it's wow. <laughs> um, yeah, that's so, it's definitely a learning curve because like everyone wants to be like, uh, I want to be the main top streamer, but like no one wants to go over and like help the the small people first you know mm-hmm. or they just don't want to go over to the big people and be like hey I, i'm i've been here like every day you know like let's fucking get it <laughs> you yeah. know like and just just kind of love on the streamers you know like mm-hmm. nobody really ever wants to do that oh yeah yeah i've i've yeah because i've been there um so what advice would you give someone that just started to stream or someone that is wanting to start streaming don't don't think it's gonna happen right away because mm-hmm. it's not uh when i first started streaming i thought like because i was like so good at the game i'm like everyone's gonna show up and then downfall happened i was like no nah, this ain't fucking working <laughs> you know <laughs> nothing's yeah. working so um do it but do it do it in a way where you're putting yourself out there with other people. No, I'm saying that wrong. Do it with, <laughs> do it with love and show people love and then start streaming. Don't, don't just expect people to show up. You show okay. up for other people and, and people will start showing up for you. I, yeah, I had to believe it or not. It was actually the pull up game. Um, AKA Yadi Dadi who actually showed that to me first about, uh, networking and just getting to know people because when I first started too I, I wasn't like that I didn't even want to get discord or join discord servers because I was scared <laughs> yeah so um, but before we move on Blur uh, is there anything you would like to add about streaming no man just fucking do it show people love man that's so funny that's you, you know you're the third person to say that um, when I get to that question. I've had you you not being the third person. People are just like, do it. Just do it. 
Just fucking do it. Yeah, just yeah. Just put yourself out there, man. Um, Be different. Mm-hmm. Definitely. Um. So this next topic that we're gonna go on is called "Tell Me About You," uh, because, like mm-hmm. I said um, before, Blur. I don't know. Cause we we just met like a couple weeks ago like you just joined and so i really want to get to know you and and so the and because you have said you have said some crazy stories before and i'm just like <laughs> yeah what um oh before we move on gunfighter okay. wants me to talk to you about something okay, okay so, all right so i've been kind of preparing myself for, for this because like I know a lot of people especially non-affiliates okay yeah non-affiliates really do get they get a good rep right like people will show up for them especially like in, in, in discords and stuff mm-hmm. like all the people they, like, they'll show up and show love right yeah but a lot of people once they hit that goal mm-hmm. a lot of people will stop showing up and so they have to like re-network themselves to get those some more people to show up um so that's that's also i just wanted to like warn like if there's any non-affiliates in here that that is going to happen oh, like yeah. like it's there there will be a downfall so don't don't drag yourself about it all you have mm-hmm. to do is just get back up and redo it just keep fucking going like you're yeah. gonna get it you know yeah just keep yeah like you said just keep doing what you're doing um don't don't let it like set you back, but it, it does happen and it happens a lot where people think that they hit affiliate and they're like, okay, I'm cool, I'm gold and everything's good. Kind of like when you first start streaming, you think, oh, a lot of people are gonna show up. But yeah, like you said, Blair. Have, um, have, oh, have sorry. you ever seen anything like that happen before? Yes, I have. Um, I seen it with this one person. Um, he, um, they were not affiliate. And mm-hmm. so every, everybody was showing up, right, to sh- like help help them get affiliated. And and as soon as they did, uh, for a little bit, for a little bit there, people were still showing up. And, and then like, but after that, um, there was maybe three or four people. Now there wasn't, there wasn't ten, there wasn't twenty, you know, right. people showing up anymore. And so um, and also I know people sometimes think when they hit affiliate, oh my god, I'm gonna make so much money, I'm gonna get rich. But no, it's not like that. You know what I mean? It, it's just, and so honestly, when you hit affiliate, it's just, it's actually more work because now you're getting channel points that you you have to create, you know, like you got to make mm-hmm. the sounds, you got to add the emotes, you got to add the gifs, like it, it's a lot more work. You, you want to spice up the channel mm-hmm. more. So yeah, that was a good, yeah, so- that was a good one. Yeah, Gunfighter and I were talking about that last night. And, uh, yeah, we really just... And I was, like, already pre-gaming for that. Like, I was, like, already, like, hey, there's some people that are just not going to show up, you know? Mm. But uh, she she wants me to ask you why. So I'm going to ask you why. Like, why do you think that happened to him or her? I think it happens because people... So... So kind of like when you hear someone's not affiliate, you're just like, oh, like, OK, yeah, let's let's get them there. Let's just let's just help them get mm-hmm. to that point. And so mm-hmm. that's what people are going to go do. You know what I mean? And and then mm-hmm. but then as soon. But if they, if that's all I feel like if that's all they keep hearing is like, no, let's get them to affiliate. Let's get them to affiliate. Like that's just they're hearing the goal. OK, they hit affiliate. They hit that goal. So now everybody's like, OK, my job's done my here. Job. We hit the goal. We, we set them up for success. We're good. And then, and like I said, I think sometimes um, when people hit affiliate, sometimes on yeah. their end, I think what happens is they don't, they also don't keep their relationships after and keep, and keep like, keep those connections. Because if you lose those connections and if you don't keep them, and like I said, they're relationships, guys. So like kind of relationships with your friends or like your significant others, like you got to keep in contact. You got to be there. You got to keep showing support to them as well or else, yeah, they're not going to be coming back. So Um, that's my personally, I think that's why. I don't mean to get personal, so you don't have to you don't have to answer it, but for in that specific situation, like 
like what like what really occurred like why why didn't he grow to the extent that he thought he was do you think um i i think like i said i think i think it's easy to be very nice when you don't have something kind of, so for an example i'm going to give with that is kind of like money like let's say you're broke it's nice to be like, oh, hey, guys, I'm normal. But then once they get rich, they start kind of treating people like, you know what? I don't need you. I don't need you anymore. Like, I'm good. I'm set now. Um, and I think that's just what happens. I think people may it's not not an ego, but they just they're just like, OK, I'm good now. I don't need you. Uh, I'm a, like, mm -hmm. I got where I needed to be. I, and so, so, and that's something that I, I'm very cautious of now because I'm not going to lie. I've mm. had people use me to, uh, to get where they wanted to get and then kind of be like, nah, like, okay. You know what I mean? Does that make sense? I don't know if that yeah, makes sense. No, I get you a, a thousand percent. And so, and I just want to, I just, I just want to fair warn, like, mm. I will die before any of that happens with anybody in the discord. I will jump on them. <laughs> I promise. I promise. Yeah. My fiance would kill me. Okay. Oh. <laughs> okay. No, but yeah. Don't so that... do that, motherfuckers. <laughs> <laughs> Love people for who they are. Don't get rich and then just fucking spit on them. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Spit like, on don't. Call of Duty. Yeah, like, don't use people to get what you want. Like, you, like, like we've been talking about this whole time. Show that love. Right. Show that support back, you know? So, mm -hmm. um, oh, this is a question from Clam. For the tell me about you, does Blur realize he will you lose his fight? I don't know. I already read that, and now I'm not losing that fight, bro. I promise you. Mm. Uh, but do you have any more questions oh, about okay. that, Blur? Sorry, say that one more time. Oh, I'm sorry. Kind of um, sorry, I was gonna say woke up in who I was gonna say. Um, do you have any any more questions about about that subject? Um, no, not really. You kind of cleared it up really well. Yeah, and that's just something that I've been kind of pre gaming for, you know, because like like it's gonna happen. Like it like if people don't want to show up, they're not gonna show up. That doesn't, mm -hmm. that doesn't mean that I'm going to stop, like, loving on people, you know, because oh, yeah. that's what I do. Like, I'm still going to show up. Like, like right now, I have I have Gotti's stream, you know, and uh -huh. he's only showed up once, you know? Like, I love uh -huh. that dude. So it's, it's not about, it's not about, yeah. uh, it's not about the people that show up to your stream. It's about what uh -huh. you do for other people, because once you start doing something for, for people, you're going to get a big benefit in return. You know what I mean? Yeah. And, and that's another thing that you just brought up about people showing up. So this um, this person that we were just talking about with the non-affiliate, um, they were saying like, hey, I've been showing up to all these people's streams all the time. I'm there, but they're not showing up for me. And something that I had to explain to them was like, hey, you can't expect people to show up. Like just because you yeah. show up to theirs doesn't mean that they owe you anything. You, you know right. what I mean? Yeah. So... So when you do things, do it because you care and you actually want to do it for them. Don't do it because, yeah. you know what I mean? So Yeah, I get you. Sorry if it looks like I'm not looking at the camera. I'm looking at Clam going crazy. <laughs> no, you're good. No, you're persistent. Good. I'm sorry. Um, real quick, speaking of Clam, everybody, Clam, I just made a mod. Um, I have to make her a mod in the Discord. I haven't done that yet, but she is a mod here on Twitch. So please welcome in the new mod. Uh, I've seen her do, do some mod work before, and she does an amazing job. So, yeah. Good shit, Clam. <laughs> you still a bitch, though. No, Thank you. How I'm dare kidding, you? Kidding. Don't talk to my wife like that. That's my wife. <laughs> No, whoa, okay. I didn't you. know that. Yeah, we're in a we're in a thruple. We're in a thru <laughs> You so haven't met Star, but sure. she's also my wife. Well, our wife. So uh, gotcha. back to back to our topic to tell me tell me about you. Um so who has had the most influence on you growing up? Sorry, Claire, um, I know R. That's that's kind of a hard question, you know. Um, I would like to skip that question because that's 
Um, we can, can we come back to that question? Yeah. That's kind of a hard one for me, and I might actually start crying a little bit. Oh, my okay. gosh. So okay, yeah. Let's, we, let's move on. <laughs> you know okay, what I'm saying? Yeah, we don't have to answer it if you don't, or we can come back. Whatever so you feel comfortable yeah, let's, with. Let's come uh, back. Okay, so uh, next is, uh, what do you have a best scar story? A best what? Scar, like a best scar story. That's like scarred me like physically or yeah, mentally. Like it, no, no, physically. <laughs> um, so I actually had heart surgery. Oh, wow. Well, it was near my heart. Uh -huh. um, so it went through my groin all the way oh, up to yeah. my heart. Um, I had an extra lung mass uh -huh. and they had to put 38 coils next to my lung mass because one lung mass was supposed to be getting blood, but this other extra lung mass was getting lung, like getting blood. And mm -hmm. it's not supposed to do that. So when I was four, I could have like blown up inside. You know what I mean? Because it was getting oh too God. much blood. So right now, Amazing. like right in this region of my, of, of my stomach, uh -huh. there's 48 little tiny metal coils that are in a tube holding blood from from getting away from this lung mass. Oh my right god. Now. So I can't ever go through like um I can't ever go through like a machine, take pictures. It's like magnetic, whatever that oh, thing's called. Shit. What is that? MRI. I can't ever go through one of them or I'll die. Oh my god. Or like a CT scan. I can't ever go through a CT scan. That is ever. scary. Oh god. I'm saying I'm over here saying it's scary and then you have ice over over here saying that's awesome. He's got cyberware. <laughs> so the doctors actually said that that extra lung mass could end up like end up saving my life. Uh -huh. So hey, thank you. You know, so like yeah. if one lung goes out, that lung mass can actually grow another lung. Uh huh. That's crazy. That That's probably scary. why I can breathe through water a lot longer than other people. How I long? My How, breath long? Like three. How long? Like almost three minutes. Oh shit! I think the longest I've ever held my breath was like two forty. Do you practice? Do you practice? No. Don't lie. No. <laughs> no, I don't practice. I, I mean, I, I'm a kid, yeah. Like, if, if you count, like, just swimming in general. Yeah. That's uh, crazy. But I, no, I don't practice. I ain't no naval, n Navy <laughs> SEAL. Fuck that. I'm happy. Well, I'm, I'm just happy you made it through that, though. That Because that sounds super scary. But, I mean, it sounds like you found, like, an, a positive thing out of it. So. Oh, fuck yeah. <laughs> Oh. I make everything positive. I'm talking about. So, Blur, uh, let's say, okay, let's say if you were going to die and the only way to live was to beat a game or a round, what game would you choose to play that you know that you would beat? Damn. That's a good question, huh? Damn. <laughs> so, that's a good ass question. Hold on. <laughs> what game? What game around would I play to survive? Mm -hmm. Wait, could it be? I'm just going to add. I'm going to add something. Could it be an endless game with unlimited rounds, but I never die? Ooh, oh, because if that's okay. the case, because if that's the case, I'm going with uh, COD Zombies BO2 all day, every all day. day. Okay, well, if you, okay, well, I guess yes, because if you're saying that you won't die, so you're saying you won't die ever in the game. Nope. All right, fine, deal. Yep, you can say that. So, cause zombies, I would mob the fuck out of that shit and never die. <laughs> um, so, my next question for you, what pickup, wait, hold up, I want to go back to the zombie thing. How, what's the bit, like, the highest round you've been on on that game my cousin and i hit round 72. oh my um, god and then a cut like a couple no i would say about a year ago i was playing on ps3 and it was my cousin and i again and we hit the max round which is like i think 144. oh my god is that like a record that has to be a record I mean, it, it stops right after that. Like, it just stays at 144, even if what? you finish a round. That's lame. That's a big, I feel like that's an L. 
But that is crazy. How many hours did that take you to get there? Uh, we didn't sleep. <laughs> we did not sleep. <laughs> uh, it took... It took us like... 24 hours. Oh, wow. 25 hours. That's crazy. That is crazy. No, it wasn't five days. <laughs> so, um, that's crazy. I, okay, I, first of all, I'd like... Do you have Black Ops 1? Do you have Zombies Black Ops 1? Yeah, you, yeah, you used to. Come, come. I was going to say, if you still have it, um, um... I was gonna say I still play it, and if you'd like, we can play together. Yeah, because baby. The highest that I've been on there on Black Ops One is like thirty-four. I think is the highest round. Yeah, I can get Black Ops One. Fuck it. <laughs> oh, you know Hit man, thank you for the biddies. I appreciate you. Welcome in. How you ignored my question? I asked how you were the other day, and you didn't answer me. But thank you for being here. Happy Friday. Um. Okay, well, yeah, just let me know if you can, or you don't have to, because I haven't played that in a, really, in a while now. Um, Sorry, my dog wanted to say hi to everybody. No, she's so, she, she's right. She's a she. Yep. She's beautiful. I love huskies. There's she's something about collar. She's got a collar with, like, a bow on it. Oh, well, you better watch flower. out. Uh, R20 says that he's going to steal your dog. Oh, oh, no, <laughs> good fight. <laughs> Ever. Gun, gunfighters getting R20 back because of yesterday. <laughs> She's typing him out. Okay, I came in and gifted and then checked another channel. My bad. You're a good hit, man. I hope all is well. Thank you for coming in for the biddies. I appreciate you. Uh, hey, we have for... to shout out Ryan, though. Okay, shout out Ryan. He, Ryan. Yeah. Oh. He, uh, he became a mod for me yesterday. It was fucking awesome. Oh, he yeah, set up he a did. bunch of shit for me. So. Oh wow! Well, shout out to Ryan. I'm gonna do. It. I'll do a big shout out to that. Wait, how do you say? Come, here. Oh. Come on! I know you went up here. Come on! Oh. I put a shout out in there. Um, onion rings. Yeah, Ryan is known as Onion Rings. You have to call him Onion Rings. So, you know what I mean? <laughs> He's so beautiful. Um. So blur for the next question is, um, what pick what pickup line have you used before and did it work? What pickup line did I did I <laughs> what pickup line did I use for you? Oh, I just asked if I could send you a dick pic, didn't I? Mm -hmm. What I ask? Hey man, no, I didn't. Wait a minute. Oh yeah, I asked her if we could FaceTime. That was just a pickup line. Have yeah. you but ha, have you ever used one before that on somebody like any, it? It could be cheesy. I want to know. I want to know all the different pickup lines. No, I can find that I ever really use. I was uh -huh. sitting in church one day, and this was before I met you. So don't get all <laughs> angry. But uh, that's not. How I was in church things. one time, and I, <laughs> and I was I was sitting there, and I seen this girl walk in, and I was like, "Is it hot in here?" Or is it just like the church, is it the environment, like, or is it just me? And then like she started blushing. Oh my god! Yeah, it, was, it was a pretty good one. It was a pretty good one. I was like, not in a church. Oh. Clam, you, you, ooh, ooh. Yes. Uh, Clam's done some crazy shit outside of a church. Okay, that's all I'm gonna say. Oh yeah, Clam, how how you? <laughs> <laughs> the point he has a point I, don't, I just had a pickup line at least i didn't get down and dirty you know what i'm saying yeah. <laughs> um the, for me the cheesiest pickup line that's ever been used on me was um what he said are you a jew because i would love to be inside jew that's what he Please, but I so aw persistent. Yeah, one more time. Are you a Jew? Because I want to be inside you. That is so like <laughs> madly. Yo, <laughs> yo, hey, yo. Clam, <laughs> that is so fucked up. Were you getting holy though, Clam? Were you getting holy? I don't know. Yeah, she would like, consider. <laughs> oh, praise Jesus. Oh. How do they do it? They go, oh yeah. Is that you? 
Ang da. Fuck. Crazy shit. So, for our next question, Blur, um, if you could send a telepathic message to the whole world at the same time, what would yeah, it be baby. and why? Oh, Miss Money. Telepathic message. I would say, ready? Huh? I'd be like, never back down, never what? <laughs> and then everyone would go, give up. Give and that would on. be it. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. Oh, no, you didn't. Uh, no, Miss Money, you didn't interrupt. Um, first time chatter, guys. And when we get a first time Welcome chatter. Welcome to the cum zone. Welcome to the cum zone. You just came into one of um, our special interviews on Fridays. And thank you for the biddies. I, I really do appreciate it. I hope happy Friday. I hope all is well. Um, OK, but hold on. Blur, why, why would you say um, that, though? Why would you pick that? No. So Nick A30, he's a Fortnite streamer. It's very PG, uh -huh. but I mean, he does have a good meaning for that, you know. And I, I support that saying like a hundred percent because a lot of people want to give up, you know. Mm -hmm. They just want to stop going, stop being who they are. And for me, I've I've dealt with like I've been in schools where where people just kind of where students just kind of they don't want to live anymore, you know. And nobody deserves to feel that way. So, yeah. um, I'm just saying, hey, you don't need to. You don't need to stop being who you are. You just need to get up and keep going because at mm -hmm. the end of the road, there's always light. It doesn't matter what you go through. Like there's there's trials and tribulations, but you're always gonna. There's always a light at the end of the road, and that's just yeah. how it kind of goes. Okay, I like that. I like that. Um. Yeah, definitely. Definitely. I like what you said about like, there's always that tunnel. I think so something that I'm learning and I don't want to get I don't want to get too deep, but something that I'm starting to learn is. um. Well, I actually just learned this other day. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> well, no, I've been learning it. For, no. Yeah. OK, it doesn't matter. Anyways, um, the point is, is I think sometimes people forget that um, they think that things that just happen but mm -hmm. they don't happen you you and, and maybe sometimes they do maybe some maybe they do but but you know a major part of it is, is you have to work to make things happen you know um yeah but uh okay I guys uh not to get too deep uh but for our next question and i'm very curious of this one what's your go-to karaoke song what's my go-to karaoke song Oh shoot! Can I look it up real quick? I, I yeah. The name. Yeah, no, that's no problem. I, I feel you. Mine, me mine is Spice Girls. For all of you that want to know, it's Spice Girls <laughs> wannabe. That's my go-to song. Nah, it's, or... deep <laughs> it's a deep throat. Rocky, <laughs> daddy, daddy don't make me go. <laughs> no. Um... Mouth wide open. Mouth wide open. Like I was at, how's it go? Like I was at the dentist. That's probably going to have to be Dear Evan Hansen. Um, Forever Friends. Is that, is that the song? Forever Friends. What? I don't know that song. Dear Evan Hansen, Forever Friends. Put that shit on right now and you will love it. I promise you. Hold on. I can't put it on now or else I'm going to get, I got, I almost got, I got a warning from Twitch saying if I played any more music, I was going to get a strip. Okay. Off stream. Yeah. I, yeah. Off. Hold on, let me get a pen, because I got you. Uh, what was it? Forever Friends? Yep, Forever Friends. By Dear Evan Hansen. Forever it's Friends. actually a movie. Forever movie. It's a movie. Dave Hansen? And it's perfect the movie. Yeah. Okay, a movie too. Um, <clears throat> so, um, for our next question, um, what's a secret talent no one knows you have? Did I tell him? I'm a rapper. Oh, yeah. That's yeah. Been a you, it has not. No, I don't think it's that big of a secret, but you won't do it. And actually, I was going to ask you, I was going to ask you at the end of the stream if you would rap for us. Maybe. Maybe. What, what, what is There's it a lot of people in rap? here. I don't know about all that. Why? Who cares? You said just do it. Just do it if it makes you happy. 
Plus, I don't know if y'all will be able to hear the beat and make it sound good, you know? Mm. Well, I don't know. All right, well, do you have to get drunk? Can we get you drunk? Can we get drunk? <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> Cheers. Clams. No, chicken. fuck it, I'll do it. Fuck it, I'll do it. My fiance right, wants me to do it. All right, all right, all right. Cool, cool. All right, we're gonna, we'll save it though. I'm gonna save it till the end of the stream. Or to our, towards the end. I got you. Um, I was gonna, so for our next question Take a is, sip, bitches. Oh, Catalina, we owe a sip. Our 20, welcome back in. Sorry, you've been timed out so many times. Clam, can you try to untime him out? <laughs> Let's take a sip. Mm, 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 mm. Cheers. It's okay. Oh. Um, oh, oh. Beer's so bad. Beer so yeah. I don't like beer. Beer gets me bloated and stuff. You no, know, this beer, I wanted to try it, but it's not my favorite go to. No. What is it? It's uh Oberon. Yes. I never had Oberon. That. What does it taste like? I don't like beer though. I feel like if even if I were to even want to. It tastes like straight wheat and beer. Oh no, nope, no. Nope, nope. <laughs> Thank you, Persistent. Yeah, I appreciate the compliments tonight. Um, so Blur, uh, what do you think has remained the same about you throughout your life? Oh, I say that one more time. Uh, yeah, I couldn't what, hear. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, what do you think has remained the same about you throughout your life? I don't know. Just. I don't know. I really don't know. Oh, really? How about you? Me? How about you? Um, yep. So, something that uh, I'm trying to. Oh, that is a good. Oh, how dare you? How dare you turn back the question on me? Um, um, no, so something that Sorry. I try to keep the same I guess about myself is just being kind and open to new people um yeah uh also something that I told myself when I was like I was like 13 at the time I I promise because growing up you would you know how when a girl's with a guy and the guy really like fucked her over and she was like sweet and innocent and then like after they broke up um, yeah. She turned into like a like a, a slut, like cold hearted, like a little thotty, little yeah. thotty. Like she, and so um, learning about that like cycle, because vice versa, like a girl could really hurt a guy, and then he turns into like a dick, or he just he doesn't care about these like girls' feelings that he's talking to. Like he he's like cold hearted, and so um, so something that I've told myself growing up is that. I will never have the use the excuse that just because somebody hurt me that I'm going to act a certain way or, or be different just because they did something to me. So um, I would say that's what I've been trying really hard to keep about myself. <laughs> so okay. I don't know if that makes sense. Uh, um, well, I think I just try to keep the same energy. Yeah, you're not alone answering that. I just try to keep the same energy with everybody, because mm -hmm. with energy comes uh, comes love from other people, you know. So yeah. if you keep the same energy and you keep going towards, you know, greatness mm -hmm. with other people, then people are going to show you their side of greatness, and it just kind of keeps. It's like a domino effect. It's really nice. Yeah, it's awesome. Um, I mean, some people are just like dicks, you know, like, you know, like persistent, but we're yeah, not going to talk red, about that. Red. <laughs> I'm kidding. Um, oh, thank you, persistent. Thank you for the compliments. Um, uh, so, Blur, if you could give your younger self any piece of advice, what would it be? Not to give up. I gave up a lot. Like a lot, a lot. Okay. Um, uh, there was, uh, and I don't mean to get like all down, but there was a time where like I was, really, there was a time where I was really about to take, take my own life. And, um, there was a lot of family issues that was kind of going on mm -hmm. and 
is most of it was kind of my fault, you know. Um, but man, if I could go back and talk to myself, I, I would definitely be like, dude, just don't give up because you're getting somewhere in the future. And that, yeah. like, I'll, I, I will write that shit down in my phone six, seven times a day. I, I will change people's lives over over streaming. I will change people's lives over streaming. And I will sit there and write that six, seven times a day. Just like in my notes. So it will it's gonna happen. Yeah. It just depends yeah, on when. Yeah, you got this. I like that. I like that don't ever give up. Um don't ever back down. Yeah, don't ever back down no matter what. Um so so for our last question on this topic, what's one thing you mm -hmm. want people to know about you? Last date two. <laughs> sure. I swear to God, if All it's right. big, if, if it's gonna be like I got a big dick, I'm gonna bro. <laughs> Something that I would like to know about myself would be like how small I actually am, you know? <laughs> <laughs> and for two, I would also like to know like how good I am at video games, you know, because I'm pretty decent, you know. Yeah, that's what I'd like to know. No, yeah, that's actually what I was telling um people before I got you on here because um I actually know a couple of other good gamers and they were I was telling them about you because I was like yeah I'm like you should definitely check them out just because like the way I see you play and everything. You were carrying us uh, the other day. I was like, God damn, bro. <laughs> uh, Persistent and I have been playing a lot, man. And, and Persistent likes to joke around with me, but he, we've been really kind of growing. And my mm -hmm. buddy Dark, and, and I, I'm really thinking about starting up a team. Oh, okay. Again. That'd be cool. Starting up a team and, mm -hmm. and, and really kind of grinding that shit out, you know? Mm -hmm. And like allowing to play other games but i'm really thinking about like kind of going semi-pro again mm -hmm. because i really want to do that like in league play my cousin and i we hit i don't know if holy's still in here holy fps that's my cousin we hit okay. i think we hit like 250 in the world in cod 2 <laughs> and uh, we were both doing like semi -pro. yeah and I kind of want to do that again. Is that the only game you've been semi-pro in? Yep. Oh, wow. Okay. And then I kind of, then, then Fortnite came out, started playing Fortnite, wanted uh -huh. to do something with Fortnite. I joined a clan called XXL. Um, okay. But that kind of fell off because the people in there were really fucking dramatic. Um. Like, like if you think, if you think like, like go back to your high school days and then like think of like the the female or dude that was like the most dramatic and then times it by ten. <laughs> That's what that oh was. God. I yeah. It was I, bad. Uh, it was really bad. And they were dog shit too. So I'm not even gonna I'm not even gonna be nice about it because they were pricks to me. Like they were just fucking ass. Like they were yeah. just bad. I don't care. Uh, you, what's X X L mean? Is it extra extra large? Yeah, it was, extra, <laughs> it, it was meant. It was meant. It was a sexual thing. Oh but my god! It, okay. Yeah, it was. It was funny for the time being, but we really tried to make it something. But then people just started getting overly dramatic, crying all the fucking time. Yeah, causing problems. Uh, you brought up. I was gonna say you brought up persistent, and persistent is definitely another good gamer. I know in Madden, he was like top six fifty. But he is definitely not. And speaking of persistent, real, I'll give him a quick shout out here. Um, he is actually non affiliate as well, guys. Um, and don't be afraid to check him out. Um, I don't know if my mods are still here. If they could give him a shout out, or else I'll do it. But that's cool. I'm really happy that you're, like, you're making um connections with other people on the server. Like, thank you. Oh yeah. That may, that makes everybody me good. Oh yeah. I'm I fine. think. Uh, I was gonna say in the server. I think. There's a lot of good people that really go out of their way to support others. And I think that's really cool. Oh, I got you, Clam. Thank you. Thank you for still being here. <laughs> Appreciate it. Uh, persistent. It will let me scroll back all the way up to see your would you rather. 
question. So if you could write it again, I would appreciate it. Um, so we're going to move on to a next, a next topic slash activity. And I call it, would you rather, are you ready? Uh, just real quick. I just want to let everyone know that persistent is like fucking close, like really close. He's right there with me. We're oh. both sitting like five. Okay. Yeah, guys, don't be afraid to give persistent a follow. Don't be afraid to go and show him that, that like support, um, and then and then imagining YouTube like YouTube playing in which I've seen it, it gets crazy. <laughs> oh yeah, just like the other night, man. I mean, we had there were so many people in one building. We had like six teams, and we just wiped them all out, no matter what. Oh fuck. <laughs> yeah, it was crazy. Um, but um, but. To our next topic. I hope you like this one. I enjoy these questions. Um, I'll ask the first one. This one's from Red. Uh, would you rather be caught having sex in public or masturbating in public? Having sex because everybody likes to watch people have sex. What? <laughs> I guess I I'm, guess that's I'm a way. Answer these truthfully, I promise you. Okay, I guess that's a way to look at it. Okay, that's a good way to look at it. Um this one's also from Red. Would you rather be banged in an isolated park by a complete stranger, aka a male, or be a bottom for his best mate? Yo. Uh, <laughs> neither. Can I say neither? I, no, you have to answer one. That's the uh, rules. <laughs> okay, so what was the first one? Uh, would you rather be banged in an isolated park by a complete stranger, which is a guy, or be uh -huh. a bottom for his best mate? <laughs> you know what? We're gonna we're gonna switch this up. I gotta switch this up. You gotta answer with me because that's the only way I'm gonna feel comfortable. Okay, fine. Okay, fine. I'll answer with you. Um, oh, that is it is hard because I don't know what the. You're gonna be isolated by a stranger. No, I don't want to be isolated. No, I don't want to be isolated because like yeah, because I'm I'm gonna be the dominant one in the park. <laughs> what? I like, come here, motherfucker. Yeah. Lay that um, shit down. Clap I'll his be ass. The, I'll be the. <laughs> mm. I'll be the. I'll be the bottom. I'll choose the bottom for his best mate. That's that's submissive, right? Right. Yeah, but like, what if he has gonorrhea? Oh my god! Stop! Why are you adding to that? <laughs> I'm just saying, like, you don't know. I don't know. Well, you don't know either. That's a stranger. They're both technically strangers. Except for I would I would I would make him get checked first. I would but, bring like a little tester with me, you know what I'm saying? But this sounds like it's like a heat of, heat of the moment. Like you just met them. <laughs> like fuck it, man. I'll just take antibiotics, man. Just fucking send it. I'll you go know? to the doctor after. Um yeah. Uh, so this okay. So next, would you rather question? This is for me. Would you rather have an obsessive, insane person love you or hate you? Love. Why love? Because I have one, and she oh, with me. Okay, that was smooth. That was smooth. I love it. <laughs> I was pretty Come smooth. Here. Come shit on my lap. Get up. Anyway, what are you saying? No, I'm saying that's a good answer. I think I would rather have love just because I feel like if somebody hates you, they will make it their goal to ruin your life. Um, you're just jealous, okay? Hi, Autumn. <laughs> I don't know. Can she hear me? Yeah. Hi. She's so pretty. <laughs> I know. Uh, if, I you, if you would like to um, answer the questions as well, Autumn, you can. That's perfectly cool. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so for our next Thank would you rather you question, I, I want her. I What the hell, Clam? You're going to cheat on me already? You just looked at her and you're going to cheat on me. Bro, um, thicker than the snicker, bro. <laughs> Damn, Clem, I'm stitching you to store. I'm telling story. You just wait. Um. So our next question: Would you rather have sex with the hottest person you know that's freshly dead, 
or have sex with the ugliest and smelliest person, but they're alive. It's gonna be her. Is she, you want her dead? No, I'm just saying, like, if she were to die and I really needed to, I'm, <laughs> I'm like that loyal, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm, I'm going to the grave. I mean, yeah, <laughs> you, know I guess I mean? you could choose if it's her. What about you, Otto? What would you choose? You're going to the grave for me, baby, or no? Sure. Okay. <laughs> You're going to the grave with me. I don't know if I could have sex with a dead person. I think I'd be too freaked out. <laughs> We go into um, the grave. Okay, so for our our last would you rather question, and then we're gonna lead into my other favorite topic is called hypothetical scenario. I like these ones, but on our last one, would you rather be stuck in a time loop or a whole different universe? I think a whole different universe. Oh wait, you didn't answer the last question. Oh, I have to answer. Yeah. I would sleep with the ugliest and smelliest person. I don't think I could have sex with a dead person. I would be too scared. <laughs> would be scared of the smell. But you could always you could always make a shower too. Yeah. See, she has a point. <laughs> Do sit back down. Get down. You could, she's like, you could always make them shower. I love see, she's got my back. Um She's got my back. I should for the yeah. See, clam and and clam. We yeah, right. You can. We there's no rule saying you can't. So. <laughs> I would, um, I'm just a girl, persistent. Um, so why would why would why would you want to be stuck in a universe? I think I'd be too scared. Well, because if you're stuck in a universe, you don't ever know what you're gonna find. So you might make some really good friends that are different. Like alienated. Okay. I think that'd be fucking awesome. Okay, I yeah, I, I'm gonna go with the universe just because I'm scared of time loops. I can't imagine repeating the same day over and over again. I think I would freak out. You know what that reminds me of? That reminds me of the Supernatural episode where um, Sam and uh -huh. Dean stuck on a Tuesday. And Dean keeps on dying and Sam has to keep trying to find a way to like fix it. But it was actually a trickster, you know, uh -huh. doing that to them. And it was trying to show Sam and Dean a point like, hey, you're loving your brother way too much. But, you know. Yeah. yeah. See, that's what I'm talking about. Like th that type of like time loop. I don't think I could ever do it. I'd freak out. I'd freak out. I don't know what I would do. I think I'd enjoy it, though, for a little bit. <laughs> Um, so, so to our next topic and it's called the hypothetical scenario you ready for this yeah um uh let's see uh okay so speaking of time loops let's say you're stuck in a time loop for a hundred years uh -huh. you can bring you can bring three people Mm -hmm. Two must be people that you know, and the other one has to be a famous serial killer. Oh, I'm bringing. So for one, I'm not bringing you because you have to be a famous serial killer. Okay, um, mm -hmm. I'm gonna bring. I'm gonna bring both my boys. I'm gonna bring Dark Salt. Uh -huh. Okay, and I'm gonna bring Holy FPS. Okay, Holy. And then I'm gonna Dark bring Salt. Ted Bundy. Why Ted Bundy? Because we're gonna beat the fuck out of that motherfucker. Okay, so holy and dark. Okay. Uh, all right. So, actually, the day that you keep reliving is that you're getting murdered by Ted Ted Bundy. I don't know if you did. You hear me? Yeah, but like Ted Bundy's gonna eat me. It might feel good, you know. Fuck it. Wait, hold on. We owe a sit. You ready? <laughs> He's like, <laughs> all right, let's go. Mm. Mm. Actually finished it. Um, okay, but I'm sorry. The day that you're going to be reliving is that you get 
murdered by Ted Bundy. I don't make up these scenarios. It just happens. Um, uh, what, so what do you think would fix the time loop? Killing the thing that, it's, that started the time loop with a wooden, um, a wooden spear with blood all over it. With goat blood on, on it, yeah. No, oh, that's the wrong answer. <laughs> I was just thinking like supernatural. All right. Oh uh, uh, no, you're good. Oh, it's it's a trick question actually, because so, um, okay, so I'm gonna tell you this is how to fix the time loop. You ready? Yep. Okay, to fix the time loop, one of you three, aka you holy or dark has to get killed by the serial killer one has to sleep with the serial killer and die and then the last one breaks the loop and everything goes back to normal so who would do what and how would they do all right it? so fuck damn all right How am I waiting? Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Okay, my mic keeps cutting in and out for some reason. Oh, it's kind of getting sorry. annoying. But anyway. Gotcha. Um, so one has to sleep with them. One has die. to die by him. And die. Yeah, they both die. The one that sleeps with him dies. Fuck. And then, yeah. And then I the want my boys to die. Well, you have to choose. Mmm. So, look, this is what's going to happen. My boy is going to die with me. Holy FPS, okay? He's going to die first. Oh, which one? Like he's, I'll sleep he's... next to him, but he ain't touching me. <laughs> no, you have to have sex with him. Uh, see, like, that ain't... Yeah, that's Ted just Bundy? how it is. Oh, fucked up. I'd rather fuck with like one of the, like the female killers, bro. Well, you didn't pick a female killer. Fuck. You picked a guy killer, and you have to fuck. Me, and you have to tell me how do they die? All right, so my boy Holy FPS gets fucking his net slick, and Ted Bundy drinks his blood, and then cuts off his arms and start eating it. You know what I'm saying? Like just like a little, like like, like a chicken wing, and then um. Holy I'm gonna said. I'm gonna die. Ted Bunny's gonna act like he sleeps with me, okay? No, and then he's gonna he's... stab me right in the jug. <laughs> no, you have to have sex with Ted Bundy. That's <laughs> Fuck, <laughs> okay, fine. Fine. We get it on, okay? We get it on non I... non gay. Okay? <laughs> I had my socks on the whole time. Okay? Okay. And and he ends up stabbing me in my jugular, okay? Um, okay. And then he just starts cutting me up, skinning my face alive while I'm still alive, you know? Yeah. Well, he doesn't stab my jugular. He stabs a part of my neck. But I'm uh -huh. still alive, and I can still comprehend everything. And so um, then my boy comes back and saves the day as I just die in his arms, dark. <laughs> yeah. And he kills Dead Bundy with a fucking, with a nine. Okay. That's yeah. perfect. Okay, that's perfect. Fuck yeah. That's per okay. You you did that very well. I think you did that very well. I'm surprised you sacrificed yourself though. I don't know if most people would do that, but that that well, was a good. One. <laughs> I would sacrifice myself for anybody in the chat and you included. Aw, thank you. I appreciate that. Well, well, I'd be careful. Well, I don't think you should sacrifice for anybody. I'll give you that advice. I'll sacrifice <laughs> okay. for anybody. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Reason? Can I? Can I state my reason behind that though? Yeah, state it. All right. It's because I love everybody, bro. Mm. I don't care who you are and what you've done. Like I'm just gonna love you for who you are, and what you're trying to do. I don't give a fuck. Like you killed somebody. That's okay, dude. You deserve a second chance. I'm dying for you. You know. Okay, I like that. Yeah, that's just me. No, I get it. There's not a lot of people like that. Um, there's definitely not a lot I'm of people helpless. like that. 
she looks so lit right now like she looks like she's just like feeling it and just chilling <laughs> He's That's gone. what I'm saying. I know. I know. I wish. I'm not gonna yeah. lie. I wish I was like that right now. Like I wish I was like like hit and just like just like have my. But she's also. Chilling. She's also feeling real good because I laid her down. And oh my god! <laughs> Take a step. And I gave her the. I gave her that good good. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Look at her face. Ain't that right, baby? Uh, yes, is that right? Hope for you, Clan Yeah, Sama. yeah, yeah right before phone call, right before. Oh, oh my god, is that why? Is that why you were breathing so hard when you got onto the camera? No, because <laughs> <laughs> you're like, oh, I'm here, don't worry, guys. <laughs> Maybe uh, it could have been, <laughs> no, it definitely was. Bro, she uh, was like, she, dude, she was reverse cowgirl, bro. I was. Oh my god! Oh, sweet lord. No. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? What do you mean this isn't the men's room? I don't get it. What does that mean? High five, though. Dab me up. Dab me Very up. nice. <laughs> oh, we owe another yeah. sip, by the way. Fuck! I don't want to drink this shit. Yep. Cheers. We're both gonna suffer. Hmm. <laughs> I'm deleting this shit off my rev like the menu. We're never getting that again. Um so no. for the, for our next topic, uh, I call it the big debate. Are you ready? Oh shit, here we go. Yep. Okay. So is it pronounced caramel or caramel? Fuck. I want to know. If I say caramel, my fiance is going to kill me. I'm going to have to go with caramel. Because caramels and apples go so good together. Like caramel apples, I mean, look at them motherfuckers. They're so great. Wait, hold on, hold on. Clam, what do you mean caramel? It's, I call it, I, I call it caramel as well. I've always called it caramel. There's only like a few people it's, out here. It's caramel. caramel. I'm never going to say caramel. Cause like caramel is like a completely different thing to me. What what wait? But I don't understand. What's the difference? For me, caramel is like homemade caramel, but caramel is just like the caramel you get from like the store or like the uh, the caramel apples that are like dipped in caramel. You see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like when my mom makes car caramel, it's her homemade caramel. Okay, you see what I'm I saying? didn't. I so you just taught me something because I didn't know that it had to do with it being homemade. I just thought people just wanted to pronounce it different. No, I I don't think it has to do with anything being homemade. That's just my interpretation of it. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Well, now I'm sitting here wondering what it what it is. <laughs> what it is? Oh, I feel it. I feel it. Uh, I'm not gonna lie. I'm feeling, I'm feeling buzzed, as they say. Uh -huh. um, That's okay. Chat, what about you guys? I know, Clam, you said caramel. I know Ryan said caramel as well. I don't know. I've always just been growing up, and they've always just said caramel. So there's four. There's Persistence saying there's four ways to say it. What are the other two? That's because I made them say caramel in four different ways while I was screwing them. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm kidding. Most North Americans? I'm not in the North. <laughs> Am I? No. I'm but not. you are North American though. Am I? Yes. You have to be. Anybody uh, in America is North American. <laughs> oh, duh. Okay, sorry. I just had a blonde. I just had a blonde moment. I literally... <laughs> Care wait, care of mel, care of mole, care. Okay, I can't persist. Care of mole. Um. Uh, just so you guys know, chat. Continent oh, Thank you, persistent. I just. Anyways, um, just so you, chat. Just so you guys know, we are coming to a very close end. If anybody has any questions for Blur or even for Autumn, uh, don't be afraid to ask in chat. Um, you could also ask I'm me so if you happy. like. 
that this didn't get as sexual as I thought. I'm so oh, happy. You don't even understand. Gonna be nice. Shut, Shut up. Yeah. <laughs> Do you want anyway. a sexual? Do you want? No. A no. I have, Big no. I have, I have questions ready for for sexual stuff. I don't worry. <laughs> oh God. Whatever. Uh. Persistence, I wanted me to ask if you're on COD tonight. And R20 wants to know, Blur, why haven't I had my sloppy toppy yet? Um, for one, I don't know why you haven't got your sloppy toppy yet. Maybe it's because I couldn't find it. Um, and yes, I'm going to be on COD tonight. Okay. Um, and I got you. I got you with the sexual question since... That's what you want. Oh, God. No, it's not what I wanted. I was just it's, I was thankful late. for that it wasn't. It's too late. It's too late. We're, we're now in the sexual. We're going to we're going to ask some sexual conversations. So I you're just feeling made... it and you're tired. You should probably go to bed. Like, no, mm. no, we're, I'm going to ask. I want to ask a couple questions. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Fuck, man. <laughs> yes, Which, baby. Rola, thank you for the videos. I appreciate it. Thank you. Welcome in, Talon. Um, so, which sexual position do you think is overrated? Overrated? Yeah. Oh, shit. I like them all, so I don't know. Doggy. I agree with R20. I think doggy is overrated. Doggy is overrated, but I'm thinking like... I'm thinking about that 59, you know what I'm saying? The one? <laughs> huh. I'm thinking that one's overrated. I think that one is. I think that one is also overrated, too. I think, yeah. I don't know. Okay, so what position do you think is underrated? I would definitely say cowgirl. That's oh, underrated. Really? Why do you think that's underrated? A lot of people, a lot of, a lot of people underrate it for some reason. At least, at least from from like the people I know. Mm -hmm. I don't know about y'all, but the people I know, they don't like they reverse don't like cowgirl. That. No, they ain't into that shit. You know what I'm saying? I am yeah. though. Love that. I wonder why. I wonder why they wouldn't be into it. I mean, you're not doing any really real work like the girl is. Right. So. I just I sit them up on their feet, you know, and just. <laughs> <laughs> For me, no, I think I was gonna say for me, I think the most underrated um position for like sexual wise is like missionary. I I enjoy missionary. I like being intimate. I wanna look into your eyes just a little bit. <laughs> don't, yeah, don't. Just grab the throat, you know what I'm saying? Move them hips, yeah. grab the hair, kiss yeah. the neck. I be yeah. doing that all the time. Like I'll start from her feet, bro. I'll start from uh -huh. her feet, go down her leg. You know what I'm saying? All the way through. No joke. Well, that's what I'm saying. And I enjoy... So for me, I enjoy kissing. I don't know why. That's just... Personally, I just enjoy kissing. And I feel like... That was my dog. Yeah, baby. What? What do you mean? Camera girl, Angie, welcome in. Thank you for the biddies. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Do you suck toes? R20 wants to know if you suck toes. Mm, I suck them toes. I put them <laughs> shit in the soup. Yeah, what? You really do? You really suck toes? Yeah, man. As long as they're clean, bro. <laughs> look, listen. Look, I'm not judging. You, I'm not judging. That's your any purpose. female. Any female is gonna like that shit. What? Yes. I've, I've I, never. I guarantee it, bro. Like, if you're actually in the mood and like you're just you're just showing them love on every part of their body, they're gonna love uh -huh. it regardless. Cause it's just, it's, <laughs> it's like a chemical, you know what yeah, I'm saying? Baby. Yeah. Oh shoot. Oh, hold on. I forgot. And you know, you got your feet touched next to that church. Stop playing. You know it. <laughs> Thank you, know you. It. Thank you, Rilla, for the biddies. I seriously appreciate Take you. Take a sip, bitches. Thank you. Seriously. Thank you. You have no idea. I hope all is well. Happy Friday. And thank you all for being here real quick. Shout out to all of you for being here. Um, you can try the commands again, Talent. I didn't have it up. So they should be working now. 
Um, sorry about that. That's on me. Um, same here, Sam. So my next question. You're not you. canceling, bro. Stop. You're playing. Come on, man. So my next question is: What's the naughtiest thing you've done with food? Ooh, I come on her food all the time. No, that's not what. Oh, we always sip. We always sip, by the way. Oh shit. Here, here. Sip this here. Mm. It's actually getting bet like it's getting better. <laughs> no, seriously, what's the naughtiest thing you've done with food? I've it's used pickles. Food. I've used pickles before. If anybody what's has the ever done that. Done <laughs> oh, we've done a fruit roll up thing. Oh, okay. She I can wrapped see that the fruit roll up around my cock, you know? No, I, I understood the scenario. <laughs> I understood. Yeah. It's fucking great. I'm sorry. No, you're good. No, you're good. I've also uh, used I've also used a um an orange fruit. An orange fruit. Yeah, yeah I've okay. used the orange fruit. Okay. Have you guys checked yeah. pickles? Pickles and blowjobs? No. We never it's, will. It's messy. I'll admit it's messy, but I mean if you like pickles, it tastes good. You know what I mean? Like, no? <laughs> No, that's just not it. Okay. Okay. Um, okay. <laughs> I'm sorry. Fuck, man. Did you know? Did you know you can buy a candy dildo made out of like a gummy? Yes. And it's big. It's like really it's I, big, like a dildo. <laughs> I've bought one. Yes. That's crazy. That's so funny. That's so funny. Um, so I had, so I have an ex and um, he actually sent it to me and it's so funny because like on the top of the box before you open it, it said suck a dick and uh -huh. my ex, my ex sent it to me on Valentine's Day. That's what he gave me. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Oh, so, really? um, so what's your biggest okay so this this could be for also for autumn as well because she can answer too if she likes um and what's you your biggest answer. turn off turn off or turn yeah on? Well, okay we could do both what's your biggest turn on and what's your biggest turn off biggest turn off is having a weird conversation i just like normal conversation during Wait, during sex i hate having like like let's let's not talk about our bills during sex. Let's oh talk about how how deep I am inside you right now. Like let's let's talk about that. Let's keep it going. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to talk about our next month's rent type shit. No. <laughs> okay. I'm good. That's so funny. That's yeah. that I feel like that is so weird to bring up bills or something. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, um, super weird. No, I'm not gonna lie though. If I'm not gonna lie, as a female, sometimes having sex, and I don't know if this is for all females, but like I've I thought about stuff like the grocery list during sex. I've thought about, oh shit, I need to clean the room or I need to go do the dishes after, or I've thought about like what am I gonna make for dinner tonight? I've I've seriously I've thought about those things sometimes. It's not all the time. But it just happens. Like you think about, like, oh shit, did I put the clothes in the dryer? <laughs> like, you done that? There is no way in hell. Oh, I got you, Persistent. You're just getting um, pounded, and all you're thinking about is, did I just? Yeah. Did I get the laundry in? <laughs> I, I, no. I, I get it. I'm happy that Autumn agrees because, like, I don't feel alone now. But it happens. It's true. Like, I don't know if it's for all females, but, like, it's just a thing. I don't Do know. You have OCD. Like Do I have what? Do you have OCD? No, I don't have OCD. I don't have OCD. You can't blame it on that, then. It's just a random thought. You guys are just weird. <laughs> it's a random thought. Yeah, what's an, L -O an LOL moment during sex? <gasps> I have. I had an I had a laughing moment during sex with an ex before and he did not like that. He did not like that I started laughing. He actually got, <laughs> he got really mad. We laugh all the time. Aw, that's cute. Yeah, that's but... cute. Yeah. Fuck, I shouldn't cute. have said that. We do laugh though. We we, we make yeah. it fun. 
Yeah, that's good like though. Cream, you know what I'm saying? Like the whipped cream. <laughs> <laughs> Pieces of going down the spine. On the above. Um, uh, what's it called? Okay, for next questions. Uh, let's Take see. Take a sip, bitches. A oh, Catalina we owe another mixer. sip. Thank you, Clamp Slamma. We owe another sip. You ready? Persistent. You're not fucking me. Anyway. <laughs> oh, oh, my bad. My bad. Um, let's see. Um... <laughs> Ooh, okay. This could be a good one for you and Autumn. Um, how do you feel about shower or bath sex? It's her favorite. Oh, really? Her, it's her favorite. Like, <laughs> it, like she loves the water. Okay, she's like a okay. water for now. For me, I don't, I don't particularly like it, but I'll do it because she likes it. Uh -huh. You know, I don't like the water just smacking me in the face when I'm hitting it. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm just, I'm smacking yeah. it in water, splashing. I'm just like, <laughs> stop. I can't see shit. I'm just feeling shit. <laughs> I'm blind, I'm like, woman. I'm like cracking up. Blind. Stop. You guys, how do you feel about shower or bath sex? Well, have you ever had bath sex or have you only had like shower, like standing up sex? I've had like hot tub sex. Ooh, okay, yeah. That, I would say that's the same as like a bath. That's, you know. Stop. Okay, um. Ooh, okay, no, you had answered that. Um. Okay, and oh, this is for you and Autumn because I love, I, I'm sorry, but I love female perspectives. Um, welcome, dude, man. How are you? Welcome in. Happy Friday. Um, Sonia, I hate it. Only one gets that's true, Clam. That's how I feel too with it. Um, okay, so how, how important is foreplay to you on a scale of one to ten? Nine. Oh, Nine. what? <laughs> he said what? You can't just do it. You have to build up to it. Like, I agree with her. I agree with her 100%. Guys that think that they could just do it, that's wrong. <laughs> that's wrong. Yeah, gotta... they just want to do it. But you got to yeah. build up to it. And you uh -huh. got to build it. I do enough building up. <laughs> <laughs> Like, if I want it, you know I'm building it up, but I'm not going extra, extra miles. You feel me? It's yeah. not the miles. Yeah. I'm not going no. Miles. No, like, you just got to do small stuff. Like, if we like, like what, like the little stuff that turns you on, you know, like, especially her. Like, if she likes being kissed on the neck and that turns her on, just kiss her on the neck. Like, that's foreplay. Oh, I know. But like sometimes she'd be wanting the extra mile. Yeah, baby. She want me to like Not time. She want me to like throw her around type shit. Well then do it then throw her around. Body, that is her preference. Body slam. Throw her around. Hold on. WWE. Talon. Talon, thank you for the biddies. I appreciate you. Um hold on real quick because I have to take a shot, Blur. I have to take a shot. I don't know if you want to take a shot with me. You don't have to. Um, I don't have anything to take a shot with right now. Sorry. Oh, let me take the yeah. shot. This is for You Talon. should take an extra one for me. You son of a bitch. <laughs> you son of a bitch. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Talon, let me know when you're ready. I'll take the shot with you as well. Take an extra one for me. Uh, Persister, I would take a shot if she came. I don't know. I don't want to take... I just don't want to take so many shots. Oh, um, uh, oh, Talon said that he'll take the shot for you, Blur. You're welcome. <laughs> All right, thanks. Um, Love you. Um, let's see. Um, damn, I thought I had more sexual questions. I don't think I do. Okay. That's okay. That's um, let me, okay, cheers, Talon. I'll take I'll take one for you, Blair. Hold on. Uh, I'm gonna take this I one. Know. It's for Blur and Autumn. 
Blur and Autumn. I got them both with this shot that's like hit me. Okay. Cheers. Um, also, thank you, Rola, Talon, and Miss Money. I appreciate you all. Oh, and Hitman. She's gone. Yeah. Oh, wow. Wow. <laughs> Um, wow. <laughs> it's Friday. Um, I swear to God, I thought I had more, more like freaky questions, but I don't. Oh, okay. Okay. I have another one. I have another one. Are you guys ready? When she gets okay. all excited, you already know it's coming. So I've actually, I've asked this question before, Blur, but now Autumn's here. So we get to ask Autumn. Um, are you, Okay. <laughs> Are you a screamer, a panter, a moaner, or the silent type? <laughs> Go ahead and answer it, baby boo. I'm right behind you. Go ahead and answer. Give it a little give it a little try. Just answer. Like what do you like to, like what do you do like when I'm when I'm inside? It, it, it depends. <laughs> Sometimes I moan, but like sometimes I don't know. Sometimes I'm quiet, and like okay. I don't. Silent. It depends on how horny you are, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Is. Yeah. How the mood is so for her is depends it, on the mood. Is it weird that like I felt that what she just said? Like it just hit. Like I felt the heart. <laughs> okay. What about okay. you, Blair? <laughs> I'm a. I'm like a. I moan. I'm a, I'm a male moaner. Okay. You know, I, I'm, okay. I'm good at it too. Hmm. I got that deep moan. You know what I mean? Yeah. Uh. Uh, th this is a question from Clam Slamma. If the sex is going amazing and the girl slips a finger in his ass, is he stopping or going with it? <laughs> uh, we uh, oh, I don't know. oh shit <laughs> she I said mean, go ahead he's done it before you know uh huh but like I don't I don't really like it at all <laughs> I'm sorry <laughs> I'm sorry I'm sorry I'm sorry I started joking on my joke uh, no <laughs> no we, I ain't doing that she's tried um, no I get it I get it what about how does is it okay if I ask her and she doesn't have to answer? But like, how does she feel about it bitches. if a guy um, if, if, if if the finger gets slipped in her ass and she doesn't have to answer? She doesn't have to answer if she doesn't want to. You want to answer? It's okay. It feels weird. It's like uh -huh. I don't know. Okay. Yeah, you <laughs> <laughs> uh, well so my next question with that with clam slamma's thing um what would you do if they stuck their finger in there and when they took it out there was poop <laughs> okay walk out yeah just probably walk out <laughs> you should wash your shit bro like there shouldn't be no shit in there period like after you shit, you should clean yourself. You feel? Uh huh. Uh -huh. First, you just go wash your hands, and then you come back and be like, "I think it's time. We you need to go take, take a shower. shower." Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> shower. Get in the fuck out of there. Uh, oh shit! Good fighter. Persistent, oh, no. are you leaving? Are you leaving, persistent? I have to say, if you leave, okay. So she wants you me to. Gunfire wants me to ask you a question. Okay, go ahead. Go for it. I'm here. Okay, she is asking why everyone calls you dick shitter. Okay. Um. But first of all, I would like to state that those are lies. I've never. Okay. I've never, and I will say this every time. I've never shitted on a dick. Never, ever, ever in my life. The reason she calls me a dick shitter is because I told the story when I was in high school. I was. I knew I was friends with a guy who did uh, anal with his girlfriend at the time. And he was telling people that when he pulled it out, she got shit all over him. And his dick. 
Nah. Yeah, and and now he try and now everybody tries to say that I was that girl, but that was not me. That was not me, and I'll tell you why. I have fears of that, so that's why it will never be me. <laughs> okay. Okay. Fears. <laughs> yeah, that's a fear. That's always been a fear because. I, because as a girl, when you're learning about sex and when you're learning about anal, other girls will tell you about like about poop. You know what I mean? Like they'll tell you like, hey, you might sometimes you got to clean yourself because you might shit. So always like clean yourself. And so that's why like, mm. yeah, so that's why I'm not I'm not a dick shitter. OK, she just wanted me to ask. I don't Oh. I'm good. You're okay. <laughs> You're like, I'm good. Persistent. Pause. Wait, pause what, dude, man? What do you mean, pause? Oh, yeah, we owe a sip, by the way. We owe a sip. You ready? Cheers. Um, mm -hmm. Let's see. Um. Okay, this is going to be my last question, and I've asked it before, but I've never asked um, I guess like a female has never answered it, so I want to ask Autumn. It's nothing too crazy. Um, because girls do it too. Um, have you ever been caught masturbating, and how did you play it off? <laughs> Why? <What? laughs> Why are you looking at me? I want to know this. I want to know the answer. Because I've been caught, and I just said, "Hey, I'm I'm busy. Hello, like you yeah. do me." Who caught you? Know? you? I think, I think it was my mom, and I, I just like I covered up, and I was like, she was like, "What are you doing?" And I was like, "Nothing. About to take a nap." And then I just like <laughs> turned around and like closed my eyes and pretended I was asleep after that. Oh my god, no! <laughs> Never known this. You've never asked. Thank Aww. God I know. Don't ask your mom. <laughs> no, don't ask her mom. Don't ask her mom. Don't do that. Yeah, That's not no. cool. <laughs> I'm gonna be like, hey, have you ever caught your daughter, you know, doing extra curricular <laughs> activities? <laughs> oh, dude, man. Yeah. I get you, dude. I get you, dude, man. <laughs> I get what you're saying now. Um what about who? Wait, so who caught you, Blur? Who caught you masturbating? My brother. Oh, yeah, you said this. And didn't you say he went to go tell your dad? Yeah, bro. Bro, I was so <laughs> mad. All right. I'm sitting there in my room, you know, doing my thing. I'm 13 years old. I'm having the time of my life, okay? I'm just fucking... Like, if you ever, if you ever watch, like, Grown Ups and you see the yeah. twins, yeah. right? Wait, maybe it's not grown ups. Anyway, there's twins and they're just sitting there jacking off in the room. It was kind of like me, man. I was just going. And my brother walks in, like, hey, what the fuck are you doing? And I'm like, hey, I'm busy. And he goes, I'm telling dad. Runs out the room. Yeah. I'm like scrimmaging for my pants. I'm like, where the fuck did I put them? <laughs> <laughs> I was scared. So, but then my, my I, dad gave me the sex talk after that. It's very, so, uh, very, oh, I was going to say, was he your younger brother? Or is he the oldest? Younger. Okay. Yeah. Younger. Have you noticed younger siblings are like that? They're like snitches. Uh, they always, always, man. Yeah. Always. They're like snitches. And you're just like, what the hell, bro? Like, worry about yourself. <laughs> and then like a day later, he got caught watching porn in the laundry room. Oh my Fucker. god. <laughs> Karma. Karma. Um so guys, just so you know, we are coming to an end. I am done with the sexual questions. I hope you guys all enjoyed that. Um so so coming towards an ending. Um and I don't worry, I didn't forget about you rapping. Um No. Mm -hmm. But Take a sip, what? bitches. A oh, we owe a sip. Wine mixer. We owe a sip, by the way. Cheers. Mm. Oh no, I spilled. Oh no, party foul. Okay. Mm. Um, what's one question you wish I would have asked, and how would you have answered it? Um. How I became me. 
how I became um, the person that I am. Um, I would have answered it by saying, I didn't let my past define me. Okay. And I started changing who I was. And it didn't happen overnight, but it definitely did happen. Because no matter what you do, you can definitely change. And I don't care what anybody has to say about that because I've seen people change. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, that's how I would answer that one. That's a really good question. Um, I was going to say, yeah, because I was going to say you, you are probably one of the nicest, well, I don't know if I, I, I feel like people are going to get mad if I say this because I know, I know, I do know a lot of nice people, but seriously, Blur, like you coming into the community and just meeting you, you've been one of the coolest guys. You've been very chill. Um, you went ahead and, you know, like started to um, like network and like connect with other people. And mm -hmm. so, um, and I'm going to be honest, you don't see that a lot in people. You don't. Um, it's, it's a learning curve you know a lot of people didn't yeah. get so for me um i viewed twitch as um i viewed twitch as just something that you would do you know just like the pass of time i didn't view it as like people could actually be you know heard you know what i mean yeah or, or people can actually feel loved and cared for mm -hmm. you know so when I when I ended up finding um, your stream, I actually showed up in TJ's stream, and I think the very oh. first time I ever met you, I said it's lit in here. I'm fucking staying, and you're and you said you typed it's always lit in here, and oh. I ended up starting, you you started I, I started showing up a lot more, and then uh -huh. I figured out that you started streaming. I followed. Uh -huh. You know, and then I was just like, man, there's so many people that are just out here wanting support and, and need yeah. it. And so I just started giving it. And I was like, this is where I need to be because this is oh, this yeah. is what I want to do. Okay. And even if my stream career don't ever take off, I do not give a fuck if my if 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 my stream ever takes off. I will support everybody. At least I'll try. You know, yeah. I'll still try to be a main supporter. I, I don't care. I actually told Gunfighter that I think last night or the night before. Yeah. Um, if by the way, if um, and this is not just you, Blur, but to anybody, if Gunfighter gives you advice, definitely listen. Definitely listen. She's definitely been um, a W with helping with yeah. things, especially giving even though, advice. Even though they're fighting right now, Wait, they'll be back. I <laughs> I'm, kidding. I'm kidding i'm kidding i'm sorry i'm kidding who said that who said that i'm kidding me who, who, who is giving you this info who <laughs> uh no gunfighter is just being a goofball yeah she's always she's awesome though um no but talon because thanks for the confidence boost what you just said right now um talon um just Though, uh, Talon, I don't even know what to say to you right now. I just, I just want to say, Talon, is that um, what I like about you is you are a W supporter. And um, I feel like since you've joined the community, you have opened up a little bit more. I think you're learning a little bit more about yourself and about just being um, about other people, like socially. So um, I appreciate you in the Discord. I really do. Like, um, I'm going to be honest, guys. Like, the discord oh, okay okay I, i'll be really quick about this but the discord reminds me of like a puzzle and like each of you are like a puzzle piece and you're important like and each and, and and just so you guys know just like a puzzle like each piece is is important because without that piece it doesn't make the full picture and 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 you guys bring a lot of different things to the table so i appreciate you all Thank you, Clemson. I appreciate it. I also want to add something too, man. Um, I came from a very small, very, very, very <laughs> small group of people. Mm -hmm. And not a lot of people knew me, right? In Twitch. I'm pretty well known about like where I'm at here in Michigan, okay? Um, I'm pretty yeah. well known. 
where I stay at, you know, because, mm-hmm. you know, they're like, oh, hey, what's up, Hunter? You know, um, yeah. went to a really big school. I was pretty popular in that school. Um, so a lot of people know me around and it's uh it's just awesome to see different people just showing love to each other you you don't just even here you know you you don't see that so keep doing it and that goes for everybody because if you don't then the world's gonna come to an end literally literally uh sorry clam i don't know why the hug thing isn't working so i'm sorry um all righty are you are you ready? Are you ready to rap now? I guess. Okay. Let's just do it. I'm ready. I don't know if it's gonna sound good. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. That's weird, Clance. I don't know why it's not working. Give him a beat. I don't I can't give him a beat. I'm not a beatbox. I can't do it. Why is this not working? No, it's right here. I got it. Let's see if this works. I'm ready. Let's do it. Let's get pumped. <laughs> oh god. Let's I'm ready. Pumped. Okay, one second. Ooh, what what's your rapper name? <laughs> HC the Dream. Wait, what is it? HC D A Dream. HCDA Dream. Yeah. Can you hear can you hear the music okay? Oh, I can't hear the music. So Alright, I'll just go acapella. Go I'll just go okay. acapella then. Alright. Yeah. 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 Uh uh-huh. Yeah, now I gotta make it happen. Man, I wish I had three wishes like a laddie. Hit sticking motherfuckers like I'm playing Maddie. Man, I gotta get it back. Told them I was sooner later gonna catch my bag. Why does everybody gotta worry about that? Man, I told them I was living first class. Fuck about a hater, what they gotta say. I told them I was elevated. Man, I'm terminated each and every single fucking day. Hey. Man, I can do it no more, man. I feel like I'm flipping my script. Yeah, feel like I'm steady, just kipping it. Man, I can do it no more, man. I feel like I'm crip walking inside of the whole church. Yeah, let me get it back. Told them I was sooner later gonna be able to make it happen. No, I'm never gonna stop that. When I cock back and I shoot, felt like I was in a Call of Duty. Man, I gotta pull my parachute. No, I'm never gonna stop that. Yeah, I told you I was higher than the price of a new pair of J's. Man, I gotta say, why does everybody gotta kick it back? Told them I was gonna slick it back. Why does everybody gotta talk about my past? Told them I was steady. Gonna run it up on a dash, man. I freestyle up in the cat. No, I'm never gonna stop that. Told him I was steady coming up the bat. Hey, I swing, man. That's just me. AC the dream. <laughs> Damn, uh, that's really good. You're really fast, too. Not really. Yeah. I don't try to be fast. I don't want, I don't like being fast, but it's just a little freestyle, I guess. No, like not fast in like a bad way. Like it really, I don't know how to explain it. Like it just really, it went with it. That was really good. Are you on SoundCloud? No, I'm not anywhere. You need to be. I'm serious. You need to be. Why don't you? Why don't you drop music? Um, it's, I don't know, man. It's just, I'm scared of what people are going to think. I was actually really nervous doing it here. <laughs> That was actually really good. Uh, don't. No, bro. Don't ever be. A, don't be. Like you said, don't give up. Don't let things. Yeah, don't give up. But like, trying to do. I don't know, man. Yeah. I do I have a SoundCloud, but I, I used to have music on there, but there's, it's not there no more. Well, I was going to say, too. Um, just like people that support you with streaming, trust me, they're gonna support you with your music. Yeah, I know. And I, I'll that, be a supporter too. There's a uh, there's 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 the name for my SoundCloud right there. Okay, I got you. I'm gonna pin it up. Right it's, it, it, it's a purple picture. I got it pinned up. Hold on. There we go. Um, that's his uh, rapper name, guys. On SoundCloud, yeah. so don't be afraid to check it out. Um, There's no also, music there, by the way. And speaking oh, yeah. of TJ, 
TJ is actually looking, he's actually wanting to start a freestyle like competition. It's like almost a competition. Like you guys will just be going back and forth. Don't be afraid to hit up TJ. Like TJ is real cool. Like he, he will, you know talk what I mean? Him. Oh yeah. Talk to TJ. He's really cool. I'm talking to him. Don't you worry. Oh yeah. Definitely talk to him. Cause he's, look. he's actually looking for more like rappers, like freestylers and. Oh yeah. I can freestyle to anything with any word anywhere. That's pretty cool. Uh, if you don't mind me asking, um, what made you, who inspired you as a rapper? Like who inspired you to do that? Uh, either the real AK or NF, both of them. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, NF is a really yeah. good one. I actually got to see NF live and it was great. It's fucking awesome. Oh, I remember you said you were going to go see, um, uh, when, who was it? Um, Skillet. You say you're gonna go see Skillet. Yep, I, I I went and seen Skillet. Yeah. How was that? It was fucking awesome. It was at Cedar Point. Wow. Yeah, it was it was uh, a really good time. I also seen a couple other bands. Uh, um, Clam Slamma, um, definitely star and TJ. That would be such a a unique um combination. <laughs> But um, speaking of other bands, who else have you seen? Uh, I've seen Thousand Foot Crutch. I've seen um, uh, Breaking Benjamin. I've seen oh, okay. Three Days of Grace. I've seen... Ooh, okay, that's a good one. I've seen Titanfall. Not the game, the band. Um, War of Ages. Uh... And a couple other ones. Okay. Yeah. Um. Like just so you, that. just so you guys know, we are literally very, very, very close to the end. So if there's any questions for Blur, and like I said, for even Autumn, um, even Thank for me, don't be afraid to uh ask now before we go and just Kiki, Kiki, thank you so much for coming in here. I appreciate you. Thank you for the lurk. But yeah, I'll oh, wait. Yeah. Ask. I have a delay, so I have to wait a little bit before. But I don't know. Oh, oh wow, Kiki. Um, do you have do you have any questions? I don't know. Do you have any questions for me? No, <laughs> not really. I'm I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. Um. Hold on real quick. Let me uh, do this real quick. Okay. Not really um, any question. Alrighty. Well, take a sip, oh, bitches. A we gotta take one point. more sip. One more sip before you go. And Blair, All right. you, you getting on after this? I am on right now. Hmm. Yeah. I got you. I got you. Mm -hmm. Alrighty, guys, we are coming to an end. Um, blur. Um, yes. Before you go, please let the viewers know where they can find you and your content and what you are working on now. Are you talking about like my music or just gaming? It it can or be anything. anything, any anything that you want. Okay, I am right now. You can find me anywhere at SBK Blur. <laughs> All my socials are SBK Blur. Um, everything. Everything is SBK Blur besides my SoundCloud. Um, I'm currently working on uh, making some clips for all the socials. Um, that's pretty much it. Okay. Yep. SBK uh, Blur is where it's at. Chat, please give a round of applause to SBK Blur and Autumn for being here with us today and having and taking their time to be here especially on Fridays, because like I said, I always know Fridays are a big night sometimes for people, especially to go and do things. Um, just to, <laughs> yeah, high five to you guys. Seriously, thank you for being here. Um, like I said earlier, SBK or Blur is a non-affiliate. 
Um, so please don't be afraid to give him a follow. Please don't be afraid to follow through after that follow. Show him that love. Show him that support. Be there. Get to know him. Um, definitely, oh, yeah. he's a W streamer. He's a W gamer. Um, and he and he's a very chill and cool guy. And he's very open. He's very open. Any questions you ask, he'll answer it. Um, oh God, is he? Okay? Are you okay? Um, I'm a good. Okay. Oh. Uh, Adam, thank you for being here with us today. Um, you're actually, so you guys are my first couple to do an interview with. I know you only answered like a couple questions, but that's actually really cool. And it was dope as fuck. So thank you for being here. It was fun. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I I've been trying just... to get her more, more around. Um, yeah. everybody because everyone's awesome, you know? Yeah. Yeah, for so. real. She's, um, I was gonna say, I appreciate her answering some of the questions. Um, I can tell she's oh, yeah. like, hi. So it's like super cute. Oh, she's gone. <laughs> she's gone. Knocked out. Okay. I, All right. I'll see you in a see bit. Ya. Thank you again so much. Everybody All give right. him a round of applause. Thank you for being here. But bye. Oh, yeah. Bye. <laughs> um, bye, Blur. And bye, Autumn. Thank you guys. <laughs> Bye. Go. Alrighty guys. I'm ending the stream. So everybody that was here tonight, um, Clam Slamma, Persistent, Talon, Ice, Rain, Rolla, Trolla, Gunfighter, I know you're lurking. R20, aka Onion Rings, um, Miss Money, Two Turn Mike, Yadi Dadi, Just Kiki. Uh, thank you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Blur. Seriously. Thank you all for being here tonight. You have no idea how much it means to me. Dude, man. Thank you for being here. I don't know if you're still here. Um, I appreciate. Oh my God. Nobody look at my messages. Nobody look at my messages. Hold on real quick. Nobody look at my messages. Um, nobody look at my messages. Um, <laughs> everybody. Mwah! W mods, W supporters and W friends. I love you guys and I will see you I will see you Monday. I hope everybody has a good weekend. Mwah. Seriously, everybody have a good weekend. Chill out and have fun. <laughs> Bye.